Thank you for joining us today. Welcome to Lift It, a program designed to help people of all ages learn healthier ways of living. We do this by empowering you to make better food choices and by living an active lifestyle. I'm Marnie Robinson, your food is medicine advocate. And I'm Chandra Barnett, your fitness and accountability coach. Today is week four, y'all. I can't believe you all hung in there with us. All month long, in honor of African American History Month, Marnie and I joined forces bringing about information, fitness, and nutrition to help improve the state of health of the black community. I feel like we have learned so much, but there is still so much information to cover. Sandra, I agree. That's why we have to challenge our viewers to advocate for their health. It's not enough to follow along with us, but please use this information as motivation to do more, to learn more, and to take care of your temple. That's why today's show is gonna be lit. <laughs> Chandra, I'll let you tell them about it. Marnie, we are working on our total body. These exercises target everything from building muscle, losing weight, to strengthening your heart and cardiovascular system and more. Then you're gonna talk about food is medicine. I'm super excited, but as always, Please remember to get clearance from your doctor if you have any underlying health issues prior to starting an exercise program. Now let's get started. When we talk about total body workouts, we can't skip on the conversation about eating the rainbow. Just as total body workouts target your physique from head to toe, likewise, eating the rainbow targets complete health from the inside out. When you eat the rainbow, you are strengthening your heart, your lungs, building muscle, promoting weight loss, targeting cardiovascular health, and even your brain. So for total body, total healing, eat the rainbow. What is eating the rainbow? It is just bringing more color into your nutrition. By color, it means fruits, vegetables, and grains. So you have to hit the produce section though. Yeah, I know I talk about that a lot, but here's why. Behind most chronic diseases is that little demon we call inflammation. Yes, he's pretty bad and the culprit behind cancers, arthritis, eye disease, lupus, skin irritations, and so many other health issues. Eating the rainbow actually helps to reduce inflammation because you are alleviating chemicals that wreak havoc on your body. When inflammation decreases, this helps prevent cancer, keeps immune system strong and our skin healthy, promotes healthy vision, keeps our bones, teeth and nails strong and also prevents blood clots. God is so amazing. He made each color to target some part of our health. Remember, he gave us every seed bearing fruit and every seed bearing plant for the healing of our bodies. The next time you visit the supermarket, fill your cart with color from the produce section, of course, and eat the rainbow. Remember, we wanna do our bodies well by eating to live instead of living to eat because food is medicine. All right, now it's time to hit that total body. And today we're gonna do something a little different. We're gonna do a high intensity resistance training workout, all right? So it's gonna be the same as before with last week's workout where we're gonna work for 20, we're gonna work for 30 seconds and rest for 10 seconds. All right, but let me show you the exercises first. Our first exercise is going to be the squat press. So we're gonna grab a moderately to heavy weight, a challenging weight for us, and we're going to as sit as if we're about to sit on a chair and then press those weights up overhead. One more for demonstration. Good, just like that. All right, and let's put those weights out to the side. So that next exercise, we're gonna drop down into a plank and do shoulder taps. All right, so we're gonna come down and get into a high plank position and we are going to tap our left shoulder, tap our right shoulder and we're tapping. Okay, those are your shoulder tap, plank shoulder tap. All right, then our next exercise, we're gonna go back to those weights and we're going to get in a wide stance, hip or shoulder width apart. All right, feet shoulder width apart. We're gonna grab those weights and we're gonna take it to a row again. But this row, we're gonna row from the floor. So we're here in this stance and I'll turn to the side just a little bit. All right, so we're gonna alternate pulling those weights up 
just like this, working our back muscles. All right, perfect, all right. That's our alternating row. Our next exercise, we're gonna take one weight. Grab that weight and you're gonna place it like this if you have a dumbbell, if you have a kettlebell, even better. We're gonna take it to goblet squats, all right? Feet are wide apart. We're gonna drop as low as we can, sit into it, and then we're gonna come up. Dip, there we go, and up. All right, perfect, that's your goblet squat. Then our next exercise, Ooh, with those weights again, we're gonna take it to a reverse lunge with a bicep curl. All right, so here we go. We're gonna step backwards. I'm gonna turn to the side just a little bit. So we're gonna lunge back and take it to a curl. Bring it forward, lunge back and curl. Just like that. All right, then we're gonna take it to a seated twist, all right? Work that ab, okay? Let's go ahead and come down to the floor. Now, you're gonna grab your weight. You can either grab your weights like this, or if you prefer, here at the end, on one end of the dumbbell, and we're just gonna tap from one side to the other. Just tap, and you're working your abs. Now, to challenge yourself a little bit more, you can bring those feet up and tap. All right, perfect. All right, now we're gonna put it all together with 30 seconds worth of work and 10 seconds worth of rest. And our first exercise is that squat press. So let's go ahead and get in position. In, two, one, let's go. Squat, press. Woo, remember we're going for 30 seconds. Make sure you sit back as if you're about to sit on a chair. Press those weights up. Woo, how are we feeling? All right, I hear those grunts. There we go. Woo, keep it going. Keep it going. There we go. We're almost to that resting point. And three, woo, two, one, rest. All right, your next exercise coming up, those shoulder taps. Let's go ahead, get in position. And let's work. Tap those shoulders. Woo wee. You're working your core, getting those abs involved. Try not to move your hips around too much. Just make those arms move, those hands. Woo, tap those shoulders. Oh boy, how y'all feeling? Woo, we got 10 seconds. Woo, keep it going, I know, I know. Breathe for three, two, one. Woo, let's rest. Oh my goodness. All right, our next exercise, we have those rows from the floor. All right, get in position. All right, let's go, here we go. And row, row, woo, there we go. How we feeling? How we doing? Good, keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. All right, let me look to make sure my people are doing good. There we go, come on, come on, good. Row, squeeze those shoulder blades together. There we go. There we go. Come on. In two and one. Rest. All right. Our next exercise coming up is the goblet squat. All right. Get ready. Woo. Grab your weight or kettlebell and let's go. Get low. Get deep. Get deep. There we go. Come on. Get deep. Deep into that squat. There we go. Woo. How we feeling, Karen? Woo! Good, Hugh, how you doing? Good, come on. Woo, how almost there? 10 seconds. Come on, keep it going. Woo wee. Five, woo, three, and one. Rest it out, rest it out. All right, our next exercise, we got that alternating lunge with those bicep curls. Y'all ready? Woo! And <laughs> here we go, let's work. Take it in reverse. Ooh wee. Oh my goodness. Woo. Woo. How we doing? Ooh, we may not be able to talk on this one. Ah. Oh. All right. We gonna rest our voices while we do this one. Yeah. <laughs> Woo. Oh my goodness, I know. We're almost there. There we go. Woo. Ooh. And relax. 
Ooh, ooh wee. All right, let's go ahead and have a seat. Oh my goodness. <laughs> ooh, how we doing? All right, let's work, let's go. Oh my God. Ooh, there we go. Ooh, did we not say the best for last? Come on, y'all. Woo! Q, elevate those feet. Come on, Karen. Come on. Yes. There we go. Ooh. Uh, almost there. Uh, come on, y'all. Oh. Are we there yet? Almost. Almost. And relax. Woo! All right. Oh, we did it. We did it. Oh. There we go. Yeah, high five. High five. There we go. All right. And that is your high intensity resistance training workout for this week. All right. Woo! <laughs>all we have for today today's show was brought to you by wheeler avenue and muscle heads gym muscle heads is located at 2715 emancipation avenue right here in houston texas so if you are looking for a really cool gym with a chill vibe come on over to muscle heads remember your body is a temple for the holy spirit so choose life by eating to live instead of living to eat and get plenty of exercise to improve the overall state of your health Tune in next time as we take a trip to the grocery store. Yes, we are going shopping to teach you how to fill your carts with foods to heal your body and that can help you keep fit. Bye bye for now.